Well, hello everyone. Welcome. Welcome to Playframe and welcome to Portal. We're going to play Portal this week because I needed something to fill a week until Psychonauts 2 came out. So I put it to the patrons and they voted for Portal and may I just say patrons, excellent choice. Because not only is this a nice short little game, but it's one of the all-time great puzzle games and one of the all-time great comedy games as well. And I've not played it in so many years, so I'm really excited to revisit it. Now, before we start, just a quick request. Uh, let's all try to be courteous and not post any spoilers down in comments. I know it seems impossible that someone hasn't played or experienced this game before, but I guarantee there are multiple people. There always are. <laughs> Every game I play that I assume everyone has seen before, I always see people in comments saying they haven't. I would not want to take away this first time experience from anybody. So let's all be courteous and uh, let's enjoy this wonderful game. Uh, let's begin. Ah, <sighs> well, let's see. Sparse sciency lodgings. Um, peppy music though. Catchy. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Admission Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur hmm. for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from... Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. Ooh. And here we are. The game begins. It's a portal. It's us. Uh, here we go. And we're through. And we're out. All right, then. Um, <laughs> so this is the puzzle mechanic of the game. Thinking with portals. It's extremely good. What a weird cell we were in. And we're being watched by a camera. But no people, it seems like. Well, all right. Um, button. Box. Door. Okay. Uh, E to pick up an object. All right. What if we were to... There we are. Excellent. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. Hmm. This aperture science material emancipation grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Gotcha. So we can't move things from chamber to chamber. Good to know. By the way, I, I usually always try to have on, uh, subtitles for these games, uh, just for, uh, for the sake of folks who could use them. Um, but it turns out this game's a bit old, and, uh, captioning standards back in the old days of video games were not what they are now. Uh, the default captions this, in this game are pretty garbage, near unreadable. I've tried, like, getting in some mods that made the captions better. They weren't much better, so we're just gonna have to... I think, honestly, your best bet if you need captions is to just try YouTube's default auto-captioning stuff, which... I mean, those aren't great, but I think it's going to be better than what the default is. <laughs> Apologies for that. Old games, man. It's a good one, though. Gosh, if there are any of you out there who have not experienced this game before, I am jealous of you. You're in for a treat. All right. One. Yep. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt Aperture Science Heavy Duty Super Colliding Super Button. Wow. She makes it sound very important. Okay, we need to get the cube onto the button. There's walls, <laughs> so we can't just do that naturally, but that's all right. We got portals, and that one seems to be moving around on its own. So where's the, um, where's the other entry? Oh, here we are. 
It was right below us. Oh, and there's our, uh, yes, we need this. Okay, it's mine now. But it, oh. Gotta wait for it to come back around. That's all right. Come on. There we are. All right, we're out. Now we need to wait for it to appear. There we are. And we can just go through. And button. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. <laughs> the comedy dialogue in this game is just exquisite. Still some of the best in video games. It is top notch. And by the way, coincidental that I'm playing this while waiting for Psychonauts 2 to come out, uh, it has one of the same writers, uh, Portal and Psychonauts. Eric Wolpaw wrote both, he did writing on Portal, I believe also in Portal 2, and Psychonauts, and the upcoming Psychonauts 2. Really excited. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. <laughs> it's so good. All right, so what do we got here? We got a... Got a device down there, automatically shooting portals. Okay, well. Uh, all right. I see you there. Um, okay. Gonna have to wait for it to uh, turn around and uh, probably shouldn't stand here. There we are. All right. And we're through. Excellent. Hmm. Why don't I just... Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational <laughs> end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you... <laughs> Every single line is just so well written and well delivered. It's super good. All right, now we can place a portal. Boop. Bam. Granted, I can only place a blue one right now, but that's okay. We'll just use whatever orange one is in the environment. So if I want to get up here, I just shoot a blue portal anywhere. And then just walk on through. There we are. Nice. Uh, all right. Onward. To the next puzzle. Boy, it's good revisiting this game. It's amazing how a lot of the dialogue in this, like the quality of the comedy here still hasn't been matched by most games. It's pretty incredible. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. You watching me? I think you are. I mean, you must be, obviously. Okay, so we've got a, um, hmm, well, we can't run across, obviously, but orange portal right up there, so, um, that'll work. Hmm, no portal on that side. That's all right, though. I can make one. Perfect. And there we go. I love seeing... Well done. <laughs> Remember, the Aperture Science Bring Your Daughter to Work Day is the perfect time to have her tested. <laughs> this is great. I don't even have to talk during this playthrough. The game is entertaining enough on its own. Uh, old source engine. Welcome to test chamber four. Thank you. You're doing quite well. Thank you. I feel like I'm doing quite well. All right, we got a, uh, got a orange entrance here. Cool. Useless, but cool. <laughs> All right, we got a button. 
uh, which opens the door. Step off of it. Door close. So we need, we need this. Um, excuse me. Can we? All right. Gonna need. Gonna need this. Uh, okay. There we are. Perfect. I'll just carry this out. There we are. Nice. And button. Once again, excellent work. Thank you. As part of a required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Oh, okay. So complimentary, this robot. If you have never experienced Portal, by the way, uh, and you're watching this, please comment. I'd, like, confirm for me. Thus far, every single game I've played that I assume, like, who hasn't played or seen this, there's always, not only, like, at least one person, there's always way more than I expect. And the older this game gets, the more people, I think, there are going to be who have never experienced it before. So if you're seeing this for the first time here, glad I can share it with you. Also, Highly recommend picking it up. It's on Steam, and it's usually very, very cheap. <laughs> As is its sequel, which is also extremely good. Uh, all right, so let's see. A little bit more of a thinker here. Slight increase in difficulty. We got two buttons uh, that I think are going to be needing to be depressed in order to open this door. I see one uh, box up there and one portal entrance right there so I can get myself up here but that box is still way over there so this is for the moment useless there's another one excellent um well we've got the portal entrance right there so why don't we just save ourselves a little time um come on there you go just took a little convincing that's fine and now I can get myself up there and yes one uh the other is still over there but I think I know what to do here. We'll just do that, and then we can just walk through this again. What an incredible puzzle game, right? As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. What? Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. <laughs> Man, this game's good. Okay, um, how do we get out of here? What do you think, radio? Boy. Catchy. But I don't want this. Um, can I, can I get out somehow? Is there another portal somewhere that I can... Oh, there, okay, yes. There we are, good. Let me out. Woo! <laughs> Okie dokie. Onward! I'm playing this with, um... <laughs> I'm playing this with a controller, by the way. Which the game wasn't really built for. <laughs> I mean, it works. It works just fine. Uh, my aiming precision and speed may be slightly reduced, but I usually, uh... I go with controllers because it makes it a little bit easier to watch. It's the uh, movement of the camera is less frantic. We'll see how it goes. While safety is one of many enrichment center goals, the Aperture Science High Energy Pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. Please be careful. Quite the disability that would be. All right, let's not touch that thing. But yeah, pro tip, if you're someone who records footage for Let's Plays or for any reason, really, uh, controller movement tends to be a lot smoother and I think slightly less prone probably to making people motion sick when they try to watch. So uh, it's worth a shot anyway. Tends to make game footage look a little bit more watchable. Anyhow, all right, let's, uh, let's see. We probably need to get that thing into that thing. So let's just do this. There we go. Unbelievable. You. Subject name here. Must be the pride of. Subject hometown here. <laughs> you bet I am. 
I'm such a good test subject. I know Valve is allergic to the number three, but I really wish that they would continue the Portal... <laughs> continue the Portal franchise in some fashion. It's just so fun. Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high-energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Well, that's... I can't decide if that's good news or not. All right, uh, there's a portal there, there's... Receiver there, so we can just, um... I mean, that should work, right? I feel like that's gonna work. Whoop! Boom! Good. Now use the aperture science unstationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Unstationary scaffold is a very good name for this. Uh, okay. To get on that, I think we're gonna need... that. Where's my, um, yes. Okay. This should work. This should work. Whoop. Ha ha ha! See, even though I've like, I've played this game before, I've technically solved all of these puzzles in my lifetime, and yet I still feel smart. Because <laughs> of how darn good a puzzle game it is. Again, highly recommend it to anyone. Portal 2, the sequel, is a longer, more fleshed out game. This was just sort of like a mini bonus that they originally shipped with the orange box way back in the day. Uh... But Portal 2 is a more fully featured, lengthy game, also very funny, and very good. And it also included a co-op, uh, little mini-campaign, which is extremely good. Like having to solve Portal puzzles with Please two people. that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record. Followed by death. Good luck. <laughs> so good. Uh, but yeah, co-op portal puzzles are, uh, chef kiss. Mwah. Very good. All right, what are we gonna do here? So, let's see, we got a... We got this pellet bouncing back and forth. We could... We could just shoot a portal here, which will launch the pellet out this way. But that is not useful tell you what would be useful, though, is letting that pellet go through that... Oh. Letting the next pellet go through there, fly out of this. Uh, maybe... Nope, that's just gonna keep that going forever. What say instead we... Uh... Stop that. Let it bounce backward. And then... Yes! Yes! Oh, well that's further away than I hoped. Hang on, let me, um, here, I can go through this, and then, uh, could do that. Is that, this feels like an unsafe jump. Is it more or less safe than attempting the vertical drop? Ugh, that seems worse. Let's just do, um, let's just do this one. Whee! Okay. I'm alive. And there's jams. <laughs> I love the radios everywhere. Who put those there? Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Well, thank you. <laughs> For the danger enhancement. We're gonna have to play the other Portal games, well, other Portal game <laughs> on this channel at some point. Maybe the co-op mode, too. One of these days. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. What? Well, that... I got nothing better to do. I mean, I could still try. Um, I love these windows into these empty-looking office spaces. Uh, and also, like, getting to see the much less <laughs> clinical, so it's just, like, more menacing-looking gear work. The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. 
<laughs> well, well, don't feel too bad about it. Uh, still working on it, though. Let's see. We got... We got this. We got an opening up there. Um, so... We could also... I mean... I mean, this seems perfectly solvable Once to me. Again, the Enrichment Center offers its most sincere apologies on the occasion of this unsolvable test environment. Well, I appreciate that sentiment, but I still feel like this might be doable. So what if I were to just, like, you know, that, and then, um, we just drop in there, you know? This feels to me like a solution. Frankly, this chamber was a mistake. <laughs> if we were you, we would quit now. Well. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. <laughs> Uh, that's just 2021, Gladys. Don't worry about it. Ah, these elevators. I would say they're hiding load times, but sometimes there's also load times. <laughs> no matter how beefy your PC is. And I'm on a very beefy PC right now. It's alright. Game still runs and is just as fun. Hello again. Hello. To reiterate. Um. Momentum. <laughs> I missed some of those words, but um, okay. Maybe we can get a little hint here. You can drop into a portal, and if you have, and it maintains momentum. Okay, so that's good to know. So we got a thing up there. Uh, if I just like jump through, yeah, it works. Cool. Hmm. All right. So, all right. We got one up there, which is very far away. So if we just, if we just do this, uh, no. If we, can I? No. Okay. Well, you get the idea. Instead, we're gonna do this, and we're gonna fall through it. Whoosh. Spectacular. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. <laughs> yes, I do. And once you unlock the, uh, once you start thinking with the momentum aspect of all this, it starts getting very fun indeed. So, okay. Ah, all right, all right, all right. I'm gonna shoot one up there, up there. I guess it had to stop moving first. That's fine. Uh, and let's fly. Whoosh. Oh. Momentum. I mean, a function of mass and velocity is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. <laughs> These line reads, by the way, Ellen McLean, I believe is her name. Awesome voice actress, and she is just so perfect as this character. Uh, all right, we fly! Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, boy. It's so fun. Onward! Two new puzzles. <sighs> Boy, it feels good revisiting this. <laughs> and loading. Big fan of loading. Next puzzle, come on. I'm ready. The Enrichment Center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environments, the Enrichment Center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. <laughs> I question their safety protocols around here, but I do appreciate the helpful advice about the floor. All right, so we got another, um, another portal device out there turning and shooting automatically. So we can give ourselves an opening here, but which one do we want to take advantage of? That one. Okay, perfect. Ooh, button. Hmm. Oh. Oh, we're timed on that one. So be it. Uh, fire! Uh, oh. Um, device, do you mind turning around and... I'll wait. There we go. 
Yes. Thank you. I'm in the room now. Good. Great. Uh, okay. So, we need to get this pellet projectile out to that target. So let's wait for the portal device to turn around, create a portal there, then we'll create a portal here, and succeed. Yes. Boom! Beautiful. Now we got a platform we're gonna have to figure out how to get to. Hang on. Let's just set that there. Uh, maybe. Okay, if the device... Um, if the device shoots a portal that yep, perfect. Good, 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 good. And we are out. Yes. I'm coming for you. Adding you to my collection. Come on. Yes. The device has been modified so that it can now manufacture two linked portals at once. As part of an optional test protocol, we are pleased to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in. Subject one down here. <laughs> Very good. All right. I now have the power of both portals, which is going to be a very good time. All right, we're ready to rock. Now, to get out of here, let's set one over there. Where do we want the other one to go? Where's our exit here? Um, where is our exit here? Well, let's start by, I guess, is it up there? Hmm. I don't know. Let's set that one over there to start just so we can get out of or off of this platform anyway and start coming up with new options what is that stuff I don't want to test it where's our exit though for real okay here we are um how am I getting out of here Oh, there was a... <laughs> I'm an idiot. There's a button right there. Oh, jeez. Okay. Come on. Hurry. Come on. Go faster. I'm impatient. There we go. Okay. I bet that when I... Let's see, orange portal over there. Good. When I press this button, that door will open, and that's the exit. And then I can shoot a blue portal through there, and then I can ride the very, very, very slow levitating scaffolding. Yep. There it is. Don't go away. There we go. Okay. Ah, jeez. There's a time limit? Oh, that's just mean. Okay. Well, I already shot the portal through there, though. That's fine. We're through. Yes. We made it! No problems. That took longer than it should have for someone who's beaten this before. It's alright, though. Puzzle 12 out of 19! Look at us go. What? I think I heard fling yourself somewhere in there. Noted. Um, but alright. I see... Okay. Space down here. And, ah, yes. Okay. Let's just make one of those right there, and then one of these down here, and then we. Yes! Um... Ah, another. Okay. Gotta get ourselves up here, then. Alright. I can do it. Woo! Yes. Made it. And I found a button. Um. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna need to stay on that, aren't I? How am I going to... Ah. Angled. I like it. Okay. Great. Let's, um, prepare to drop again. Woo! Yes. <laughs> Love it. All right, can I just, um, hmm. 
Can I jump that far? I don't know. Let's find out. Woo! Just made it. Perfect. Yes. All right, now let's drop one more time just for fun. Yay! <laughs> All right. Next puzzle. I enjoy this elevator time. A chance to reflect. Think on puzzles past and the puzzles yet to come. My 13 out of 19. Short game. Now that you are in control of both portals, this next test could take a very, very long time. If you become lightheaded from thirst, feel free to pass out. An intubation associate will be dispatched to revive you with peptic sal and adrenaline. Yikes. Uh, Alright. Okay. So we've got numerous buttons. A box. A pellet flying around. That needs to get into there somehow. Uh, another button here. Which does something. Ah, probably opens this door here. And that. Uh, Alright, I need that. Thank you. Let's just drop this right there. Perfect. And now let's, uh... Oops. There we are. Now let's go through here, and we're into the next room. Good. Okay. Um... Hello. <laughs> uh... Okay. Alright. That shouldn't be too bad. I can get this one here. Um, was I too late? Did I send it? In yep, I sent it into the other room. That's all right. Another, please. Okay, and that's going to go there, and then that'll fly through there, and yeah. Nailed it. Hmm, there goes scaffolding. Ah, okay, we're going to need to drop onto that to get that crate there. So let's, um... Wait for our moment. And go! Ha! Got it. All right. You are going to go... Where are you going to go? On one of these buttons. Hmm. I need a crate for each button. I'm gonna have to go back and get that crate back there, aren't I? I think I am. Okay. That's fine. Um... Well, let's just get this down here, uh, and, oh, <laughs> uh, that feels good. Okay, then let's get ourselves, uh, back into this room on this side. We're not going to be able to get back through this door once this closes, so instead, let's create a portal there, and... Then, this door closes, and that's fine, but we can drop this through. Yay! We did it. And we can just drop through ourselves. Taking care. There we go. All right. And then we just... Whoop, and, whoops. Did I just shoot a pellet in there? Ah, whatever. It's fine. As part of a previously mentioned required test protocol, we can no longer lie to you. When the testing is over, you will be... Missed. Aw. I will miss you too, robot voice. Her name is Gladys, by the way. Spelled like the word glad and OS. It's very good. <sighs> 14, alright. Yeah, what well, the hey, let's do one more that we can save the rest of them. For tomorrow. All subjects intending to handle high energy gamma leaking portal technology must be informed that they may be informed of applicable regulatory compliance issues. No further compliance information is required or will be provided, and you are an excellent test subject. Well, thank you. Um. By the way, if you've not played this before and you're wondering, could some of these puzzles be solved multiple ways? 
Absolutely yes. This one included. Uh, <laughs> and if you've never seen a portal speed run before, highly recommend because they find some bonkers ways to solve some of these puzzles very fast. <laughs> it's a delight to watch. Now, we need a pellet to land here. I don't even see a pellet. Uh, there's a... That up there. Uh, how might we... I have an idea. Wait, nope, I have a better idea. Let's try this. Let's try... We're flying! I uh, just aimed the wrong way. Let's, um, orient this slightly differently and try it again. We flying and disoriented. Uh, oh gosh. Oh no. Oh dear. Okay. Ah, darn it. <laughs> the idea is sound. Can I do this? Will this work? Probably not, but I'm going to try it. Actually, this... This is closer. Let's... Yeah, this I feel slightly better about. And also less nauseated. Whee! Go! Ha-ha! <laughs> the other way could have worked, though. Is all I'm saying. By the way, if you hear any... I don't know if you're going to hear it at all or if it's going to get picked up. If you hear any, like, drilling or what sounds like construction noise, there's some sort of renovation happening over in the apartment next to us, and it has been happening for, like, a week. And there's just... No time of day, apparently, when there's not drilling noise. <laughs> Hopefully it won't be picked up by the mic. Uh, wait, what's over here? Hello? Oh, here's where the pellet is. I see. Okay, well, I'm just going to go over here. That seems pretty easy and straightforward. But in order to get the pellet where we need it, well, maybe there's an okay place. Let's uh, try this. Fly that way! Uh. All right, I can follow you very briefly. But I do not need to be touching that pellet. Dangerous. Okay. Uh... And then... Does that work? I think I just messed it up. I think I was supposed to shoot a blue one up here. Yep. I done goofed it. Alas. Let's try this again. Wait a minute, are you gonna shoot another one? No, you're not. No, you're not. You're the receiver, not the... Yeah, okay. Take two. Okay. So. Or blue one's over there. Let's fire orange right here. And then we follow. I hope this will work. I guess the timing will have to be right. There's probably a better way to manage this, but... Fingers crossed! Yes! Very, Woo! very good. A complimentary victory lift has been activated in the main chamber. <laughs> There was probably a better, less luck-reliant way to set that up. In fact, I know there is. The point is, I'm in an elevator now. And no one can deny that. An elevator of victory is what this is. And here we are. Tell you what, let's go ahead and call it a day. I will be back tomorrow, and we will play some more Portal, all right? By the way, I have linked to the playlist for this full playthrough. If you're wanting to watch it all the way through, it's down in the text description below. I will see you tomorrow for more Portal. Goodbye!